was a, another terrific game to watch end to end. End to end, um, what was disappointing is we walked on the how they scored their two goals. That's what really frustrates me because um, one's along. They've scored a lot of bo- a lot of goals from long ball from the goalkeeper flicked on and the other striker getting on it. They've scored our second phase from set pieces. We switched off, we let Lisby free in the box, you can't do that. We let Mooney free in for the first goal, and you can't do that. And we've worked all week on that. And those two moments are what irritate me the most, because if um, where our ambitions are to be this year, those kind of things were where we were bottom five last year. Um, this year I want to be top six, if we can. And if we can get rid of those silly errors, I think we carry enough. We you know, we've, we should have had a penalty, no question. Absolutely stonewall penalty, which it was given outside the box as a free kick. Um, but all credit to Orient, they, they've got their win and we move on. You got yourself back on level terms, a good finish by Jabba Ibrahim. Yeah, it was a good move, great move. Um, we got into the box and Jabba finished exceptionally well. We've had keepers made two or three good saves early on. Uh, and it was a bit end to end. I said it'd be a good, good game. It and it was, it was a good top six game, which was very close, competitively, uh, it was a competitive contest. Then it was. There's not much between the two teams, you know, there wasn't much between it and... Um, just a, a, just a switch off moment. Yeah, switch yeah. off, it's the ball away and Lisby gets the yeah, header. It's a switch off moment and, you know, we're, we're desperately disappointed with the defeat, but we move on. However, I need to uh, set the standard here, set the bar high and we, we, we don't like losing.